Hey, this is Ernest here. Um, you know, I know there's this big brouhaha going on, uh, Paul, that you accused um, Andrea of stealing uh, my Facebook friendship status. Um, you know, I don't know. I don't know what happened, but uh, I think, you know, Andrea has kind of earned herself a place as a Facebook friend. Uh, you have too. But I wanted to settle this dispute once and for all, sort of mathematically. I'm going to sort of send you through uh, kind of what my thinking is um, and how we should settle this once and for all. So um, I need you to pay attention very closely to the next part of this um, video. I think it'll really help settle this thing and kind of also point to the future as to how you can better earn my friendship. So. Please listen very carefully. I think you're going to find this very informative. Thank you. Okay, here we are on the face-off friendship stats. Uh, here are the rules, folks. Uh, Paul and Andrea, I want this to be a fair fight. I want you to understand uh, sort of how this all works. Uh, to the left, as you see over here, this is the axis, which is the like factor that I use to evaluate friends. And, of course, here is the timeline of the history of what's happened. Uh, look at me as kind of the super delegate of Facebook friendship stats here. Okay, uh, first off, we met Paul in January here with his wife. Uh, that was really good. Uh, talked a little bit about what we, he was doing. That was great. Uh, he then invited us out for Starbucks. That was great. You know, he's heading up there. Then, of course, he talked about, you know, meeting together next year, so that was really good. So, you know, Paul was kind of cruising around. Then he invited me to be a Facebook friend, so that kind of put him up there a little bit. And, of course, he's really heading up there on the like factor. So things start cruising around here. And then in March, he invites us out to dinner, so that was really great. We found out that we were going to have dinner with his wife as well, so that was even better. So that's heading up there. So Paul is like, you know, the guy's got swagger, you know, he's doing really well. And then April rolls around, and he talks about this one thing thousand journals okay so that's like a nice spike there so Paul you're really looking good here and then of course at the end of April that's when we meet Andrea of course Andrea had it going on when she walked in the door so uh, you know she was a director okay that's really good so that was really hot then of course uh, she had this great film which I loved okay so that was like really really hitting it then you know she says you know she's so happy to see us and then, of course, she becomes my Facebook friend. Oh, yeah, and that, that's really getting it up there. And after that, then she says, uh, hey, you know, she kind of, like, defends herself in this Facebook fight. So that kind of earned her a few points. She's traveling around the world promoting her film, so that garnishes a few points. But then she then posted us on her blog. Boom! That did it. Her whole thing went up high there. Look at that. She's just cruising around. So I'm just saying, Andrea, you're doing well, kiddo. You got swagger. Like it. So, Andrea, you win the Facebook face-off. Paul, you're going to have to improve, man. You got to do something over here, man. You got to do something to kind of bring up your score and kind of let me know how good of a Facebook friend you are to me. You know, so uh, that's where I leave it. Uh, you guys, uh, you know, have a great weekend. And that's it. So, uh, Paul, uh, get to cracking, man, on stuff you got to do to improve your Facebook score. All right.